Hey guys, what's up? By Sectatron here from One Hive Gazette, here with the next video, and this is a quick announcement video. Want to let you guys know of some things that are happening, and also ask for some feedback because, as you guys can see, the interface is new here. Um, this thing below here, uh, new iPad, has a little bit of a different uh, aspect ratio, so uh, need some stuff to fill the other side of the screen. A lot of new stuff has happened. Um, software and hardware wise for the making of my videos so i want to talk a little bit about the future of what the type of content and the format of what you're going to see on the channel um, so let me just first start by saying sorry if you hear my dog in the background um, not much i can do about that but uh, anyway earlier today i uploaded a kind of a pilot video almost of um, what I kind of want to start doing, which is stuff with other members in the clan, collaborative stuff, more live action, and I just started using the OBS software, which makes it much easier to do that, and I can also uh, stream much easier. So my question to you guys first is, is this a better format? Do you guys want to see uh, the face cam up here, a Discord chat below? By the way, this is not a picture. It is a live... Um, little image of the discord so you guys can see who's talking someone mentioned that in the last video if if you're hearing a discord chat you want to see the people that are talking in it so i added that feature um, but the question is do you guys want to see this and possibly have people come into videos more even if i'm just doing a town hall 10 hog attack strategy do you want to have you know one or two other people in the uh, discord chat to talk a little bit um, for live action and stuff should I have the Discord chat open more? Because what the new software has enabled me to do is have other people basically in the videos in a much easier way, able to talk in real time. And I'm also able to show who's talking below. I also have a little image below, um, right below my face cam right here that I can change each video. So the question is um, not, you know, am I gonna ever do this again? Because I, I'm definitely going to have this set up for um, for live attacks and for certain streams and stuff I want to do in the future, which I'll talk about in a minute. But do you want to see every video formatted like this? Or is it okay just to have the full screen of the Clash of Clans gameplay in my voice uh, in the background, which is a little bit easier uh, logistically for me, but um, this is also a very cool setup, I think. So I want to know what you guys think of how everything looks, if you want to keep the face cam, and uh, what you guys want to see on a regular basis. Now that being said, things I'm definitely sure I'm going to be doing is first for live attacks, the live with one hive, the first episode you guys just saw. For those types of things, I am going to have uh, the face cam, the discord chat below, as long as the software works out, which I think it will. As you can see, I already fixed the lag for the most part. It seems to not be as much of an issue. And also I have, this is my iPad right here, um, hands-free. It's wireless uh, connected to my computer, the mirroring, so uh, I can move my iPad around much easier and it still is shown on the screen for you guys. It's still mirrored onto my computer. So that's nice too. Um, makes it easier for live attacks. So for those types of series and streams and stuff, I will have this interface and uh, you guys will hear from other people hopefully that are in the Discord chat. So that should be very cool. I'm thinking as CWL season uh, three approaches, what I'm going to do is have streams of the last hour of the war, um, give you guys a glimpse into kind of how it works in terms of the planning, um, who's kind of doing what, the scramble at the end to try to win the war. Um, it's not gonna be catering to an audience as much, so there might be periods of time where you don't know what's going on or it's a little bit quieter um, because you know the war is taken very seriously and we can't uh, you know try to put on too much of a show for you guys. But I wanna give you the window into how the end of a war looks in One Half Genesis in a CWL type war. So that's definitely a type of stream I wanna do. And I'm hoping to do you know at least weekly streams because now that I have this kind of software, I can have people in the Discord chat down here um, and you can hear them as well. So I can add more people to it. I, I wanna do videos like that for sure. Um, but I guess the only question I'm asking you guys in this video is do you wanna see this uh, set up on a regular basis or should I go back to the full screen gameplay? Um, 
get a Town Hall 9 attack going. Should I go back to the full screen gameplay uh, when it's just like a Town Hall 9, you know, attack strategy video or like a base destruction or something that's just kind of a factual, here's some attacks, here's some bases, whatever. Um, doesn't need to have all this. I don't know. It's something I want to see what you guys have to say. And uh, who knows, maybe for even just kind of uh, more mundane videos almost, I can still have people in the Discord chat talking with me. One of the great things about the OBS system I have right now is that it enables me to stream much easier. Basically, instead of hitting record, I just hit stream. It's that easy. Pretty much no changes between this setup right here and what you'd see on a stream. I would change the little picture below, but besides that, everything's going to be the same. And yeah, I'm looking forward to the future of this. Hope you guys are as well. I wanted to let you guys know what's happening. So CWL starts one week from this weekend. I probably won't be around. I'll be on vacation for week one. But um, as we get into week two and later weeks, um, you guys should see a lot of live content from that as well as just content in general being uploaded onto the channel. So I hope you guys are as excited as I am about the new setup we got going here. And I look forward to seeing what you guys have to say about it. So that'll do it. We'll go ahead and fast forward here as you can see have the iPad right here that's uh, currently playing the attacks. I think the um, the only maybe small issues I see is there might be a little bit of a lag between what I'm saying and my uh, mouth moving. Um, I'm not sure how much I can adjust that. And the gameplay might not be quite as smooth still as it used to be when I was using QuickTime Player. So maybe for certain videos I will go back to QuickTime Player. I don't know. It depends if it's worth it to sacrifice a little bit of the um, of just the smoothness of QuickTime Player for being able to have this whole interface here, which I can really only do with the new um, recording software for my screen. So anyway, that'll do it for this video. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bisectatron out.